Now the White House says millions of doses of Pfizer's coronav coronavirus vaccine will go to pediatricians, family doctors, pharmacies, and children's hospitals as soon as regulators give the green light. So about 28 million children between the ages of 5 and 11 could become eligible for the shot as early as next week. Melanie's joining us now with more information about this. Good morning, Mel. Hey, good morning again. So interesting, we're getting some information on who will be able to give out that shot. Like pediatricians, parents might feel a little more comfortable with having that discussion with them rather than a pharmacist. So children in that age group have accounted for about 9% of reported cases in the U.S. overall. Officials say they expect about 30% of parents will get shots for their children right away, but many still have questions. We are getting closer and closer to that really important milestone. A COVID-19 vaccine for kids 5 to 11. Pfizer's vaccine just got the thumbs up on emergency use authorization from the FDA's vaccine advisors. Recommending approval of this vaccine. So what happens next? The FDA now needs to do its deliberation, taking into account the advisory committee's input. And then after that, the CDC's advisory committee will meet. That's on the books for November the 2nd. If they give it the go-ahead, the CDC is expected to make it official, possibly with modifications. That means the nation's 28 million kids, 5 to 11, could be eligible for their first shot by next week. But some parents are still hesitant. A recent survey shows only about a third of parents of kids in that age group plan to get them vaccinated right away. And there are some common questions that doctors say they're getting right now. Like, what about the potential risks of the vaccine? The cumulative benefits outweigh any potential risk. My child already had COVID. Would a vaccine still help? The level of your immunity against reinfection is really profound. It goes way, way up. What about safety moving forward? The safety monitoring of this vaccine will continue. It has actually been quite intense. And health officials say they are ready to roll. Now, the FDA could issue a decision about the vaccine by the end of the week. The agency typically goes with the advice of its expert panel.